Hey you guys, it's Jamie Anthony Seven X here bringing you episode 18 of Let's Play F Battle Fantasy 4. In the last episode, we made a bit of progress into the waste disposal plant. And in this episode, we're pretty much just gonna continue doing that. Uh right off the bat here, I suppose we could take this, this little encounter here. It looks pretty straightforward. These guys are all reach electricity, I believe, so yeah, we should be able to make quick work with these guys. Shouldn't be too threatening at all. Uh, let's go. Yeah, let's go plasma field on that guy. Okay. And then you out. Ouch. You can just, uh. Uh. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. Okay. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, there we go. Alright then. Not too bad, not too bad at all. So, I didn't really come into this with anything specific to talk about, so. Ooh, some, uh. Glasses should be really ooh, pink potion. Haven't seen that yet. Uh, let's see. Is there anything back here that we still need to get? I don't think so. I think this place has been pretty linear so far. Yeah, we can't uh, do anything with those two doors yet until we get to uh, those levers that we saw in the lower right corner there. Uh, Ringu, I'm sure that's safe. That's the worst that could happen. Okay, so we have a big slime over here. Okay. Oh, that that guy doesn't look too good. I think I'll scan and then leave this battle, actually. Theoretically, you could just keep going in and out of battles until you get, like, uh... You just get some of, like, the random occurrences like that, for example. <laughs> Perfect time. Alright, what do we got here? Big Sludge Slime. Uh, I think they're pretty much the same. Uh, these guys also aren't immune to instant death. I wonder why that is. Or, uh, they're not weak to it, actually. Sorry, yeah, that, that makes sense, actually. Never mind. <laughs> Alright, Thunderstone should take out all of them except the big slime there. There we go. And the biggest weight is definitely holy. He, of course, uh, Lance never learns any holy attacks. Uh, just by, uh, at least normally he doesn't. There might be some special skills that he can learn. Which, uh, if that's the case, I'm probably gonna want to teach those to him, but definitely do that. That'll just do damage. Nice. Okay, so, yeah, he's, uh, he's pretty straightforward. As, as expected, he's pretty much the exact same as the smaller ones, just uh, larger. And he's not immune to stun, so yeah, he's uh, he's as good as dead now. There's really... Uh, there's really nothing you can do. <coughs> ah, sorry if I sound a little loaded, I just had Popeyes. Oh my god, it's so good. But I'm so full. I didn't even eat that much either, it's weird. Oh, it's delicious though. I have to say that Popeyes is probably like my favorite uh, like chain restaurant. Ooh, battery. Oh yeah, there's another battery over there. Yeah, we're definitely gonna have to uh, find a way over to that at a later point. Uh, oh jeez, yeah, I'm full now. I'm having the compulsive urge to yawn again. Uh, curses. Stop recording right after I eat. <laughs> Not the best plan. Alright, these guys aren't weak to electricity, so I'll uh, have some bombs. Oh good. That's pretty much what I was hoping for. What's a mad have that's good against some wind and water? Uh, I've not upgraded that water attack at all, so uh, eh, those aren't especially impressive either, though, to be fair. Uh, I'll just do that. I should kill him. There we go. Okay. Pretty standard so far. Let's actually try this out. There we go. Not bad. Oh, it gets, you, gets her mana too, huh? That's pretty cool. Make sure you put that in mind. Yeah, now he's siphoned, so, uh, he ain't, well, he's dead now, but... <laughs> if he'd stayed alive, he wouldn't have been able to use any, uh, skills that required stuff. You know what, I, uh... I wanna try Ragnarok. This is one of, like, my favorite limit breaks. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah. It just spawns a whole bunch of really big weapons. It's great. A couple of those weapons have been seen, uh, in the game and were usable. I don't know if, uh... How many of them are in this particular game? But uh, I guess we'll see later on. I know the, like the yellow pole arm on the left, or with the yellow spike, I believe was a uh, an electric staff or an electric weapon for uh, Mad in the last game. But I don't, or that might have been this game actually. I don't remember actually. I guess we'll find out. Might have been both. I'm not sure. Uh, something else I was gonna say. Oh yeah, in the earlier uh, in the earlier games in the series, I believe in the first and second games. Uh, originally there was some sort of, uh, 
creature carrying that with the really big ooh gas masks. So cool. Uh, what was it? Oh yeah, there's uh, there's a large creature carrying the, the sword, but I believe it was uh, it was a reference to a game, a very blatant reference at that. So I don't feel like walking away from the fountain. So he took him out when he started making the other games. I don't think it was even in the uh, in the third game, but I, again, I don't remember. Um, let's just go through. So she doesn't have no, she doesn't have a damaging limit break yet. You should change this. Okay? Oh my goodness. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I really hate yawning on camera. I just feel as though it's very unprofessional of me, but... Eh. That's what happens when you decide it's a great idea to record right after eating. I just wanted to make sure that I have videos for, uh... For tomorrow and probably for the next couple days. I'll, I'll do a bit of recording today. I suspect I'll have some time to record tomorrow. Uh, Thursday, that is. The 20... or what? 3rd. But, uh, yeah, I'm not entirely sure on that, so... Uh, should I have him use his limit break? Uh, sure, why not? Might as well. It's all in good fun. Ooh, that really hurts, actually. No, maybe not. Not as much as I would have liked, at least. And hopefully, Mac can finish him off. I should upgrade Swift Slash more. Yeah, definitely. I know it's not really his thing, but even considering that, I still end up using that attack a lot. So, oh my god, that counters with Swift Slash. Are you kidding me? That's like the best freaking thing ever. Amazing, he has 17 health left, that's bad. Oop, he's not attacking. Oh my god, how did I know that was gonna happen? I didn't realize that freaking countered with Swift Slash, that's great! That's like one of the best counter moves right there. Just cause it's... Uh, that's one of the only uh, counter moves that I can think of that actually attacks multiple targets. That's fantastic. Uh, you know what, I'll, I'll get the healing item, sure. Why not? I certainly am not gonna feel like going back to the fountain, so... I we're gonna be seeing one of those soon. Feels though we will very soon, actually. Oh my god, he's just like healed back all his HP. Uh, yeah, definitely. The bolts are the best bet right now. She, oh, yeah, she doesn't know any uh, holy magic yet either. Oh well. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Yeah, that's a 100% bomb. I think this will do more damage. Nice, nice. Ooh, now he's staggered. I'm gonna hit him with a really strong attack. Uh, still don't have eruption. Something that definitely should consider fixing soon, but... Ah, nice. Uh, what was I about to say? Oh yeah, Natalie probably has the most... In case you couldn't tell already, she probably has the most diverse, uh... Move set in terms of, like, the elements that she can learn. Especially if you teach her the correct, uh... Special, uh, moves. She... She's gonna end up knowing a lot of different stuff. And she's, she's just gonna be incredibly useful. In general. Uh, found... Uh, still no fountains. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Well, there's a secret there at least, but unfortunately it's not a healing fountain. I don't know if there's any. I don't think there's any uh, hidden healing fountains right here, so I uh, guess I'll just wait around a bit. There's the internet sparked behind me. Don't touch it. A whole internet. internet excuse me. Can I, I know it's a reference to something. I'm afraid I don't know what it is. Actually, just a box. I won't have to do any work. Fantastic. This guy. Uh, this guy doesn't look. <laughs> too safe. Uh, I feel as though this was an enemy that was added in the update. I don't recognize him. Um, hmm. I'm gonna hold off from fighting that guy for now. He looks kind of deadly. Let's go fight this, this new enemy here. Which channel is this to pick up? Yeah, this is the first, I believe, of three enemies that uh, are basically just different elements of uh, Satellite dish sort of things. Oh, the dish, I think this is the electric one. Yep, thunder attacks. It may stun, siphon, and dispel. This is basically the support out of the three. As you can see, it's resistant to a lot of different uh, status inflictions, and it's weak to uh, pretty much the usual stuff that the, the machines around here are tend to be weak to. But, uh, yeah, which is interesting because they actually use electric attacks, but they're still uh, to electricity, so, you know, that's always fun. It certainly makes sense, but... Um, yeah. Oh, really? The one character who I really would rather didn't get siphoned. And they get siphoned. Yeah, see, they don't do... Oh, and she's stunned, too. Wonderful. They really don't do a lot of damage, but they're, uh... Pretty much the main thing that they do is just to, uh... It's just to mess with you, pretty much. Uh... Ah, yes! Now the Medipack, uh, restores status problems. I don't think it did that a little while ago, but now it does. So that's good. 
heal her, and then she'll be able to take her turn and have her spells back. Wonderful. Just use that, I think. Uh, let's see if I can take this guy. That's probably not going to do enough damage, but that's fine. Nope. Okay. Oh, there's Dispel. That's fine. Maybe we didn't have any buffs anyway. Okay. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's immune to stun. Oh, no. It's resistant to it, I think, right? Yeah, okay. That's cool. Works for me. It's not like it's going to get another turn anyway, but... No, that's cool. <laughs> it's actually surprisingly powerful, considering that uh, it's just the first level of his three elemental... Uh, skill tier things, whatever you want to call them. Uh, ah, steel key. Uh, you know, now that I have that, I'm actually going to go back and use that. Mostly just to give Matt some time to regenerate. There's some spikes there. I think those deactivate when I take that battery, but I'm not entirely sure on that. We'll, we'll have to wait to find out. Uh, but yeah, I'm pretty sure earlier on in this place, like right over here, there should be. Yeah, there it is. Okay. No, 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 no. Oh, oh, I can't resist. Oh. Ah, space helmet. No special effects. It's like very defense. Oh, wow. Huh. So, there's some interesting resistances. Hmm. That certainly is different. Probably, uh, either at the end of this episode or the beginning of the next episode, I'm gonna go through some more, uh, skill. some more skill set, uh, upgrades. That just seems like something I'm probably going to be doing more and more often now, as we start getting AP faster, and, you know, have more of a desire, or more of a need to actually upgrade this stuff. Let's fight this guy first. Okay. Dish turret. Uh, it's just a single wave, so it's not going to be too deadly. Oh, just, oh, crap. Yeah, I forgot about that. Uh, stupid copper fish, man. Whatever, I don't even care. I'm just going to... I'm just going to be killed. Go. And let's see if I can take out one of these guys. No, unfortunately not. Okay. Should actually upgrade that attack. That'd probably be a good idea. Why did they always attack a Lance? They fit those weapons in there. I don't know why, but Lance always ends up taking such a beating. Uh, better heal him up. Yeah, as I said earlier, uh, the more time goes on, the more you're going to be seeing Nat as uh, it's an almost entirely you defensive character, and one who pretty much her primary focus is just to buff and uh, and heal the team and stuff like that, which is why I'm just now actually, I'm starting to consider, reconsider whether or not I actually want to give her all of the, uh, the different special skills that I'm considering giving her, and uh, she doesn't have anything as we do, so walk with that. There we go. But I mean, considering, I mean, she's still going to be doing a lot of damage, granted but a lot of the special skills I plan to have her learn are offensive, so yeah, I'm not sure about that. Uh, and here's the rest of the spacesuit. I only cast Scanbot between turns, huh. That would certainly be useful. And this one is just uh, frozen and stunned, huh. That's actually a pretty good armor set. Uh, I'll look into that after I clear out this guy. I think before I fight the next enemy, I'll, uh, I'll upgrade my stats and then uh, We'll probably fight him in the next episode, I think. That sounds like a plan to me. Uh, let's just use Plasma Wave. Alright, uh, yeah, these guys are gonna learn. Oh, they're all both stunned, though, so... Whatever, that's fine. I'll just use, uh... I'll just attack him. Oh, that guy first. There we go. Uh... Yeah, I reckon it doesn't really matter. Certainly both gonna die this turn, so... Actually, oh, that's right, they're not weak to electricity. Whoops. Think about that. Uh, I'm the crap out of these guys. <laughs> I don't, oh, that's right. Oops, forgot about that. Uh, I don't use any summons in a while. Uh, it's actually not weak to water. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I have much in the way of summons that would be effective against these guys. Uh, I'll just do no legs. Yeah, it's probably more effective than a swift slash, to be honest. Oh, well, okay. I forgot that those guys sometimes do that. Yeah, they just kind of have a serious. Oh my goodness. <laughs> my limbs. <laughs> and I've seen everyone slam fight except Anna. Oh, well, uh, she died. Ah, that means that I have to eat the coffee. God dang it. Oh well. 
I really should just buy a whole bunch of those. But I'm trying to save money until I really need to spend it. Because I feel as though that's when it's... I don't know. I feel as though... One, as soon, oh dear. As soon as I decide to do that, the game is just going to get really hard. And then I should have spent my money differently. And yeah. I have a tendency in games... I don't know if I brought this up before. I have a tendency in games just like... Save up everything and just build up everything until like to the point of absurdity and then by the time we, I actually need it like the game's over and <laughs> there's no point in me even using it anymore so yeah that tends to be how I play games <laughs> just in general it's not like I do like it's just kind of it's not like I try to do it to do it that way but I'm just always worried that if I use something then oh my goodness what is going on here I can't just Whatever, I'll switch, uh... It really doesn't matter who I switch out. Just bring you in. Let's try Arrow Rain, actually. We haven't seen that attack yet. Yeah, not especially impressive. Not surprisingly. I completely forgot where I was going with that. Yeah, I save things up and, uh... Tend to not to spend them. <sighs> this feels kind of nice. Oh, good, that missed. Okay. Jeez, this is really brutal, actually. I'm not sure why this is so difficult for me. Right, I'm just gonna heal you up. Uh, coconut? No. Pumpkin will do. I'm just gonna be slumified for the next several turns. And she's gonna die. Okay, so it looks like Matt alone is gonna be getting experience for this battle. That's fine. Well, that was awesome. <laughs> oh, look at all that. Oh. Why is there so much experience for that one? Is it because... When you get experience, does it like disperse it among the people who are alive so that like if only one person's alive, then it, they only get the experience? I'm not sure actually. Well, whatever. That's fine. Ooh, another piece of flare. Replaces a weapon set's effect. Huh. That's certainly uh, interesting. Weapon set's effect. Uh. Uh. I suppose I could give that to Lance. Sure, why not? Okay, so now it's gonna take a little while to get for these guys to regen, but that's fine. That gives me some time to, uh. Oh, my nose. Ah, to work on equips and stuff like that. Uh. I think. I think I'll give Matt, Matt the space stuff. Well, let's see. One of the current benefits of that. Yeah, that's pretty good. The main thing I'm using them for really is the resistance to electricity. And considering that this also gives that, yeah, I can switch over to this. And I mean, come on. Why wouldn't I want one of my guys that's literally just like an astronaut? Let me see if I can upgrade it now. <coughs> okay, good. Oh man, look at these resistances. Uh, I'm not going to take it quite that far yet. Yeah, go up to level 3 for now. Jeez. Yeah, he already has enough electricity resistance to start absorbing it now. <laughs> oh, that's great. I should start upgrading this stuff a bit. Yeah, there we go. Uh, what about that? No? Okay. I'm probably gonna give him the, uh, gas mask, actually. Yeah, let me do that quick. <coughs> I think at least. Well, uh, tank cannons is pretty useful. Until I can upgrade the gas mask a bit, I think I'll hold off on that action, which I can't. Oh, I can't right now. Right. Uh, Eh, I'll hold off. I'll hold off on that for now. Uh, upgrade that. No, oh, is that silver plate? Yeah, sure. All right, sweet. Looking good. Looking good. Flares. Well, I can upgrade the iron cross. Bomb and stagger resistance. Uh, that's yeah. That's pretty pretty cheap. I should take that. That's not very useful here. Uh, yes, the pocket clock is uh pretty good. Uh, it's not that good. And, okay, now we can do skills, I suppose, how many... Oh, wow, quite a bit of AP, okay. Uh, for Ana, what would Ana be useful for here, in particular? Uh, hmm, probably stuff like Arrow Rain. It's not all that powerful, though, that's the only problem. Spark Arrow is good. Fresh is pretty good. 
heals and blesses. Reflex, that's that's very useful actually. Let me uh also expensive. I have just bought all the skills for her. Hurricane, uh got uh, decisions, choices, finds uh eh, I'll just eh. That's fine. Fresh, yeah sure. You know, for Matt, I for Matt, uh, he really needs to learn Eruption, but it's just not going to be that useful here. I, think, I love how it completely covers his face, like he can't even see his, uh, his facial expressions. <laughs> you can see the little, uh, the little, uh, thing there, whatever it's called, I forget. Yeah, I honestly can't even think of the term. Uh, well, I can't upgrade Big Spark, so... Not sure there's much of a point of it to be honest. Uh, ah, yes, here's Giga Drill. The more I was uh, telling you about that I found, the more they buff their defense, the more damage it does. It's, I believe it's the lowest, it's the attack with the lowest elemental percentage, only 25% earth. But, yeah, Matt and Lance can learn it. And I'm probably gonna teach it to Lance, because Lance doesn't learn any earth type attacks. So,. I mean, I should teach him that. Just just for fun. I feel as though that could be really useful against bosses. So, I might as well give that to him. Uh, do you want to just... Yeah, why not? Uh, bamboo Trap. They both already have poison attacks. So, this one's just going to really be a judgment call. So, I'll wait on that. Ugh, I can't. I just can't resist any longer. Eruption's like one of my favorite attacks he learns. And I, I just can't think of any possible reason to just not have him learn right now. And, uh, yeah, Quick's pretty good, too. Although now, he'll be able to learn Cataclysm. <laughs> uh, great attack. I think that's good for him right now. It's for you, I uh, can't upgrade Thunderstorm. That's fair enough. Maybe Thunderbolt? Ooh, good learn Firestorm. Great song and great attack. Uh, oh, wait, she does have a, a light attack. Right, I forgot about that. I can teach her Judgment. Genesis. Oh, I need Judgment to learn that. Okay. Yeah, Judgment it is then. Oh, and I can actually learn this then. Uh, yeah, this is a really good limit break. Targets all foes, may weaken them, but revives or gives auto-revive status to all allies. Yeah, it's really good. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but, oh, it's so good. And it will do quite a bit of damage as we, uh, as we upgrade it more. Uh, as for you, uh, it's not gonna be useful, but... Uh, I'd actually kind of like to learn that sometime soon. We should learn bullet hell. Uh, yeah, sure. There we go. At this point, this is probably the point in the game where I'm just going to be diversifying my uh, move set a whole bunch. But uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I'll start heading over here just to explore. Uh, ah, this is here actually. Yep. Outside, then take a finish here. Yeah, that's basically one of the things about this place is that now we can go back to the front and get the battery. And also this guy's, uh, apparently there's a quest in there. I forgot about that. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you liked this video, check out the description for a link to the playlist. If you, so you can check out the other episodes if you haven't already. Alright, here's another, uh, steel door, or steel lock there. And, uh, yeah, also in the description you'll find fun links like, uh, if you're interested in joining the full screen network, there's a link down there where you can apply, uh, spreadsheet store, uh, social media stuff, uh, well, Special these computers. <laughs> Technology enthusiast, I agree. <laughs> uh, and it doesn't even know what a computer is. Okay then. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys later.